All right, guys, jumping into Final Fantasy X Blitzball, back into the tournament for Weather Pass 3 and Elite Defense. So Sykes are taking on the Beasts, we are taking on the Glories. Let's see what we can do. It's honestly, it's been a minute. It's been a minute since we've uh, we've played Final Fantasy X Blitzball. I've been uh, working on a few other things, 10-2 uh, Blitzball and then also... Um, the uh, the let's play of uh, Final Fantasy VI, so it's uh, it's good to be back, you know, playing Blitzball some more for uh, Final Fantasy X and so on and so forth. Yeah, all in all, this should be a pretty straightforward, easy match. I don't really, uh, I don't know, I don't really anticipate too many issues, right? I mean, that's the big thing. We're just gonna, we should, in theory, be able to roll through them. Uh, we're definitely going to get more wins in this series than we are in the 10-2 series. <laughs> we're, uh, we've been playing 10-2 Blitzball, and it's been, uh, it's been a little bit rougher than you would, you would expect. Uh, definitely uh, a challenge. Yeah, we're going to encounter gear, take a tackle. Um, mistake on my part, I need to probably get more accustomed to playing this game again. I say it's been a minute, but it's been like a week or so. Yeah. That's the thing. That's the thing. I think people don't realize, because um, uh, I think it was uh, Resistico was saying this. He was like, "Oh, it's been this long since you played," and I'm like, "Yeah, I mostly, uh, I mostly what I do is I'll play like a bunch on the weekends, and I'll record up, and then during the weekdays I'm busy with like work and stuff like that. So, I uh, there actually is kind of a large interval between. Like, I'm not playing blitzball every single day for like six hours. Um, Honestly, if I was, we'd probably be done with the series by now. <laughs> Six hours a day. I mean, I think a whole series, um, if you guys, the actual number for, like, time, I think for 10 is, is it, like, 60 hours? Like, an average series for us is about 60 hours, something like that. It's not, it's actually not that long when you think about it. Like, 60 hours, like, that's just a work week. Like, well, a little over a work week. Depends on the work, right? <laughs> yeah, so it's actually not uh, its not that bad. Yeah, we're going to attempt to score on Noi. We got the ball on their side of the field, so that is nice that we have uh, we had that pressure on them. And we're going to have Bada challenge. Bada will get the ball. So the thing about Bada is we just got to pretty much immediately stop. Um... Trying to avoid any sort of encounter with Gira. The problem is, Bada, he just can't. He just can't keep the ball. Like he's gonna. It, it feels like, to a large degree, he's just gonna be like forever losing it. You know what I mean? It really is a. Uh, really is a challenge for sure. But yeah, Gira's gonna go for the attempt here. I mean, yeah, two minutes in, but no, uh, no goal. That's really unfortunate. Uh, a pretty bad super goalie, but it is good enough to stop the attempt. Pass will go all the way out to Jossie. That's actually good. We don't... The last person we want the ball to be passed to is Bada. So, Jossie's... He's safe. Jossie is safe. He's perfect. He's he's a good... Uh, he's a good person to receive the ball. So, we're going to pass to Bada here. Um, I said last person we want is Bada because um, he was closer to Guado. But after that tackle, we have, a, we have a little bit of distance. Yeah, Walker with the ball. We're going to pull back a little bit. Take the tackle. Um, I gotta go for the Aurox Spirit there. They're causing me some trouble. So we gotta... We gotta go for the Super Shot. Yeah, I think today I've got like, uh... This is the... So it's the night... Or, or sorry, it's the 20th today. I think I've got like... I don't know, I might record like 7 or 8 games. So it shouldn't be too bad, but... This is the first one of the day, so I'll have to get a little bit more, uh... More used to it, right? Like, more, like, accustomed back to this. 10-2 uh, blitz balls. Weird. You don't do anything in 10-2 blitz ball. Let me tell you. Uh, in terms of like uh, controlling the game, like you set morale, and beforehand you set like positioning. Like a lot of the 10-2 gameplay is outside the actual game of blitz ball. Like it's the, it's the development of your team rather than the the playing of your team. You know, more more like football manager. So it's a little bit different. Um, yeah. I don't know, I think they're, in all honesty, I just think they're hard to compare. Uh, it was funny, I was on stream today and someone asked me, like, which one would you like, if you could only play one, like, which one would you play? Um, if I had to choose, I'd play Final Fantasy X, let's uh, for sure. 
Um, I think there's just more to it. Um, that's not to say Final Fantasy X-2 is bad, but it's just personal preference. I prefer uh, Final Fantasy X Blitzball. I will say, um, I think I've said it before, I think X-2 is a lot more balanced, though, because the AI controls everything. It's It's... It feels like more of a fair game, right? Like, 10 is rough because you start out the game, you get a little bit of experience, and then you never lose a game for, like, 300 games. It's like it's crazy, right? Like, you just, you're just insanely good. But there is that kind of, um, that kind of back and forth in, uh, in 10 too. Like, it is not, you know, like, oh, you're just going to win every game. Like, there is genuine challenges. Uh, so I really, I don't know, I really like that. The one thing I don't like is the opponents don't level up. So in 10-2, the opponents don't like increased stats. They just stay stagnant. So if you beat an opponent once, you're generally going to... I mean, especially if you crush an opponent, you're generally going to win again. Which is a little bit... I mean, you kind of don't want that, right? You want you want that back and forth, that those tough matches. You can also train the opponent, though, so there's ways. All right, well, Bada is gonna start with the ball. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna pass back to uh, Josu here and see if we can get the ball kind of pushed up. We got two goals for now. Uh, definitely not like the a superstar showing on our part. We've uh, we've gotten a little bit thrashed, but I mean, we this is still recoverable. We could still get some uh, some pressure on them. I mean, to be fair, regardless of what happens, we're, we're probably winning this match, so th there is that. Like, we don't have to worry about a loss here, at the very least. Yeah, let's push up with uh, Dotto and see what he can do. Dotto's got good speed, should be able to survive the tackle, and then should be able to pressure Noi with a potential goal here. So all in all, all really great stuff. All really great things. And there it is, 3-0. So you got Nav Guado with the ball. Nav is going to push midfield here. Going to get challenged by Bada. Bada could steal this. Question is, what does he do now? <laughs> uh, I'm going to go for it. I, I hate it, but I don't, I don't know where else to go. Right? Like I just got to hope that I survive the tackle. All right, we do. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We survived the tackle. I mean, that is, that is fantastic. Otto's going to take it and then uh, take the attempt on uh, Dotto and then Dotto's going to attempt for the goal. I mean, 3-0, hopefully making this a 4-0 soon and, you know, making the glories goners. Got the blitz off. Nav Guado will start with the ball here. Uh, Nav push him left side. I don't hate it. It's fine. Uh, going for the wither pass. That is really good. If Nav had taken the tackle there, that would have just been... I mean, uh, without mincing warnings, that, that would have been downright foolish. You know, that would have that would have been stupid. Oh, but Zazzy, he encounters almost everyone. Like, what does he do here? He's just he's just stuck, dude. Like, there's no there's no real good way out. So we're going to swim, swim, swim around a little bit. Pass to Jasu, and then try to kind of push it up a little bit more. Again, we're not really that concerned about Guado. Like, we can get encountered, we can get tackled. There's really no, uh, there's no real reason to fret, right? Like, why would we care? So yeah, we're going to swim around a little bit. And this should give us the opportunity to pass to Dotto. And Dotto, another opportunity to try for the goal. We might actually need to consider moving around our strategy and using Waka more because I feel like Dotto, isn't he, he's actually kind of like powering up in terms of level. Like he's getting really high. And there it is, 5-0. I want to I wanna say there's some disparity, but I could be wrong on that. But yeah, Nav Guado with the ball. Uh, Nav is going to be pushing left side here. I don't hate it. It's good. Bada's going to tackle through.
Oh, I don't avoid. I was I was trying to think like how do I get in the middle of everyone, but I'm not able to. And Gira will steal the ball. Uh, this could translate into a good situation if Gira goes for the shot here, and uh, gets keep us some experience. I mean that's not bad. Okay, if you're not going to go for the shot, I'm going to go for the real tackle then. Gear going to pass to Zazzy. Zazzy, of course, is going to receive this. It does make sense. Gear was right next to uh, Keepa, but that didn't seem like a good idea to shoot it. Uh, instead, it made more sense for uh, Zazzy to encounter three other people and try to shoot past them. Pass to Dotto. And we're just going to have Dotto push up with his 91 speed. He was at 92. He was better, but now no, no longer. Take the tackle and then just go for the attempt. I mean, at this point, like, Ada has not been lucky at all and has not been able to stop us. There it is. 6-0. So we got Navguardo with the ball. Uh, Nav is going to push uh, left side. 18 seconds to make a difference. Going to go for the wither pass two to Zazzy. I mean, this is 100% going to make it. Uh, there's just not enough time for them to do anything else. I don't even think there will be an encounter. Yeah, it's going to be 6-0 final score. Glory's losing out. So a little bit of experience for them. A little bit for us. Yeah, it looks like Dotto is a little bit ahead. I mean, no level ups, but it's, it's all good. So uh, Sykes 4-1, the Beasts, and then we 6-0, the Glories. Not too shabby. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. When you come back, we are going to be playing more Blitzball. Till next time.